So the Utah Electric Array, uh, it's built out of silicon, and it's a very delicate small device. Uh, it is about a quarter of an inch on a side. Uh, it's composed of a hundred little micro needles that are about an eighth of an inch long that project out from this silicon substrate. Each one of these little needles is electrically isolated from its neighboring needles by a mode of glass. So each of these needles is, serves as an independent electrode. When this device is implanted into the central nervous system or into the peripheral nervous system, each one of these micro needles talks to or listens to a group of neurons around the tip of the needle. And so when the 100 electrode array, uh, which contains 100 of these micro needles, is implanted in the cortex, this device can listen selectively to the neural activity in hundreds of neurons with unprecedented selectivity. Not only can it be used for uh, understanding how the brain processes information, but there are many clinical applications that uh, this technology could be suited for. Historically, uh, neurologists and neurosurgeons uh, see patients who have disorders of the nervous system or who've experienced tra traumatic injury to their nervous systems. And again, historically, these individuals have had few options in terms of treatment of these disorders. Um, the work that we're doing with the Utah Electrode Array technologies and the applications we're doing, we hope, will provide these neurologists and neurosurgeons with a new set of tools that will really, for the first time, allow them to actually treat uh, these pathologies rather than just simply diagnosing them.